Hey guys, uh, Max and Magic here. Today we're just going to be talking about the Snap Deal. Uh, if you don't know what the Snap Deal is, it's just a beautiful little move that looks something like that, where the cards seemingly vanish uh, as you deal them. I'm just going to be going over how to do it today. But, um, yeah, let's just move right into it. Alright, so the way I think I'm going to be doing this is I'm just going to show it, uh, or I'm just going to teach it, and then I'm going to do it again from an exposed angle, probably from the side. So, for this, I like to use the four aces. Now, when doing this, you can do as many cards as you really want, logistically. Uh, however many cards you can lateral palm is how many cards you can do this with. Um, I've seen someone do it, like, up to 13s, or... Yeah, around 13, so if you can lateral palm that many cards uh, well, go ahead and try it. Um, if not, though, uh, four aces looks nice, and even one card. So um, how this works is as you're coming down, these two fingers are extending, which creates the noise of snap, and you're catching it in lateral palm. Uh, for those of you who don't know lateral palm, uh, just think I'm throwing around a big word, it, that's, uh, that's essentially it. Um, you pin it's basically a pinch, uh, like that. So from that angle, it's, uh, you know Tenkai, it is the angles are pretty similar. Um, that's Tenkai, uh, that, there, that, or that, but, um, essentially, just like that. You're snapping it, and your thumb is guiding it, and your ring finger is catching it in lateral palm. Some people might say lateral palm is more uh, like this with the middle finger, uh, just holding it like with the middle finger like that. However, I don't like that as much. I find it works better as a pinch. I, if that is a different name, then I'm sorry for that. Uh, but in terms of doing the move, I think that's just what looks best. And at the end, I just clean it up with a little lapping, um, which basically, once you have it in lateral palm, so, uh, so let me palm those things, sorry. deal the last card, I do swipe down here, swipe, just drop them, uh, I come all the way to the edge, and one more swipe, so in motion, it looks just something like, uh, well, or be cleaner, but you get the general idea, you just cover it under some restriction. Alright, that's it for the tutorial. Let's move on to the exposed angle. Three, two, one. Alright, great. We're at the exposed angle now. So I'm just going to run through it one more time with a side view. Alright, that is the snap deal. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope I will see you again next time. Thank you. Hey, sorry, I just realized this while I was editing the video. Um, I didn't talk about angles for this. Um, it's pretty obvious. Uh, if someone's right in front of you or looking down, just angle slightly up. Not, not like that, just slightly. like Just enough. And still move around freely. Um, just when you move around, it really sells it. Obviously, don't do this trick when someone's at this angle. Don't do it like this, this looks too suspicious. This is just the best angle. Looks the best, sells it the best. Um, yeah, I just realized that in post, so I'm sorry I didn't go over that earlier, but yes. That is the angle that you want to use when doing the snap deal. And I hope that you can actually learn this move because it's very nice. Thank you.